Okay. I'm here. Interestingly enough, I looked in the uh, the file for this game, and it, it's called Puddle Phobia. Yet the game's entitled Just an Ordinary Bike Ride. So I'm I'm wondering. <laughs> Puddle Phobia, you say? Hello, I'm a muffin, and this is uh, Just an Ordinary Bike Ride or Puddle Phobia. However you want to do it. I might entitle this Puddle Pho Puddle Phobia because I kind of like that name better. But there's been an update to this game. The person who created it reached out to me love it love everything about that do that please if i play your game 100 percent. i'm here for you hemoschine okay okay <laughs> the developers of this game hemoschine which i believe are a duo i'm not entirely sure but uh they reached out to me and they're like hey we updated it come play and i was like yes because this game does have some potential to it there's a lot of really cool concepts in this and i also heard that apparently if you turn around right at the beginning there's a thing um, although I might be wrong about that. That might be just pure bullshit spewing out of my mouth into your ears. Without further ado, we're going into it. I love a title screen that instantaneously changes into the game, like, that smoothly. I should get home now. It's cool. It's been a few hours. Yes, it has. It's quite nice, and we hope to do that on... Can I turn around? Aha! I see! I was not misled. There is some shit back here. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! Fuck! Bike, come on now! Get up, get up to the freaking thing. Ugh, okay. Profile. <laughs> Entry type, presence. Presence type, unholy corruption, you say. Anomaly type, <laughs> current containment status. <laughs> it's fucking loose and it's an anomaly because that's what that means. Oh fuck, this is hard to read. Description, entry, bleh, is one, or, is one of or more unique creatures in on file. Entry manifests itself wherever <laughs> are found. Puddles, uh, see, I'm guessing that's puddles. Said blank can be found within a few miles of where the creature re currently resides. It is undetermined if this blank if this is blank regarding the creature it is theorized that entity this entity that entity fuck i can't read it is theorized that entity blank can blank multiple times multiple of them to blank pray it is undetermined which blank above is used that being said entity blank is not the worm like creature the entity itself is thought to be <laughs> specified information about the blah <laughs> itself such as blah <laughs> or otherwise remains unknown throughout the likely to be bunny blah <laughs> discovered entity blah <laughs> was first discovered after deep investigation of a mysterious disappearance said disappearance was to be blah <laughs> <laughs> however after the <laughs> <laughs> after ruling out any <laughs> were sent to the area the disappearance was thought to have occurred and found <laughs> The exact origin is unknown. Wow, this is this is very indis, indis, in specific lore. As mentioned above, entity blank uses an undetermined blank of worm-like creatures for not only defense purposes but also for catching prey. It appears the entity blank does not blank in any known natural method. Instead, it opts to consume the blank from prey it captures. See entity one one. Entity blank utilizes blank for various abilities, including the blank of the previous mentioned creature appearing entity typically makes a temporary dwelling in caves with high amounts of blank oh probably those crystals okay so i get what this blank is trying to do is trying to kind of like you're supposed to guess and kind of like get involved with the lore but i don't know if i want this at the beginning i might want this a bit down the line but i don't know we'll see containment currently there is no cons can, uh, consistent form of a containment method the entity's appearance is blank currently the most can be blank the most can be done is to blank as the entity will flee when it believes its prey has fled well that was something special so that's what they meant by like turning around right at the beginning okay 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 now i'm Okay. What did it say? Turn back some other shit? Fuck. Oh, is that a hint to get me to go read that thing back there? Yeah, probably. Was that the update? <sighs> or is there more to come? Because if not, go watch the first video because you need to you need that context. Alright, I'm gonna have a big ass cut right here. 
because this might be kind of similar shit unless there's more stuff in the future but we'll see we'll see we'll see all right so if you didn't know i actually already have a video on this game this is a part two to an extent there's an update in here and in the first video i already go through this part uh for a vast majority of the time there are some bits that i did not catch in the first video and i will be showing those there here and there but for the time being if you're concerned with missing some footage it's basically the same thing. Just watch the first video. All right, buddy. Okay, bye. Ah, okay. There are some things that are being added that are a little bit actually... They're quite... That's quite nice, actually. That's good. Because, like, there were some times that, like, you really had to look to, uh, like, notice if there was a thing there. Now it's a bit more obvious, and I appreciate that because... That's what was was lacking. Oh, it's coming up with it. Oh, okay, that's a little that's a neat little touch there. That's cool. <laughs> like really fast just kind of jiggles like a like the back end of a uh, a rattlesnake's tail. Oh. Well, this isn't really the best idea, I would say. What if I don't do this? What if I just turn around? But I'm at the end. Oh, you know, fuck it. We're going, we're going forth. We're going forth into, okay, no, he's gone. All right, is it the same cutscene, or do I got something different this time? Still dead. Go to the options menu, press P, enter the passcode. Fucking what? Oh! Fuck, what was it? I'm gonna go watch my own video to find out what the fuck that was, because I'm not playing through that again. One second here. Event underscore 13. Okay. Wait, is it capital? Oh! I did it. What the fuck am I? I don't know. I had to press enter like a shit ton there. I don't know if that was a glitch or something, but I got through. What is that? Can I go in the doors now? Help! Help! There's a snake in the road! It's a goddamn frickin' alien worm. You guys seeing this shit? Help! Why is it this foggy, too? Do I- is this my hat? Or can I see my eyebrows? I must have some thick eyebrows. Oh! Oh, shit, Sonny Jim. Alrighty. An entrance. I should report this back, too. Pardon? Pardon? Who's watching me? God damn it, the feds are on my trail. Can I not go inside? No, I can't. Is that glass? Can I not get in? I can't get in. I can't get in. All right, fuck, can I? Oh! Oh, no, I was just supposed to go straight. Oh. This is where the bike hit. What was that? Creature's probably still here. <laughs> oh fuck. Oh fuck me. Where's my shotgun? That was so casual. Uh I don't have my shotgun, goddammit. Hold your boss music. Calm down. <laughs> Oh my god. God damn it, just another Tuesday for this guy. Oh, there it is. Send in all we got. It's like if an angsty teen just perceived the world like everything that would make a normal person wide-eyed screaming. This guy's just like, nah, it's just a casual Tuesday. You know, world's about to end. The mentions are closer together than you think. Yeah, you just get used to it after a while. That was fucking hilarious. And why can't I shoot you, you fuck? What the fuck, ass? Oh, wait. Are there controls? How do I shoot? Well, I'm fucked. Where's my shotgun? Or was I supposed to have my shotgun during this endeavor? 
Oh, screw me. Hey, how you doing? Editor Ben's back to tell you that I'm a dumbass. And you know what? Hey, uh, who could have predicted that one? You actually press one on your keyboard to get the shotgun up, and I spent a large percent of my time kind of just roaming around looking for a, a weapon to pick up not realizing that I had it on me the whole time. And I also broke the game a little bit too, where if, if you go over to the, the crystals and get hit by them, if you projectile far enough, you can get off the map. So that was something. What the fuck? One. Is that what I was supposed to do? Oh, he's sad. He's fucking sad. Get him while he's sad, boys. Oh, nope, never mind. Oh, I can go inside the thing. Okay, 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 okay. I see how you do. I see how you do. Or not. He's in an impenetrable fortress. Pardon? Okay, now I'm confused again. What if I fuck up your crystals over here? Fuck your damn crystals. Ah! Is that it? That made, that made a zappy sound when I hit him. It's something to do with these fucks. Oh, you know what I think I need to do? I need to, like get his balls to hit this. Shoot at me. I dare you. There you go. Okay, now come over here. Oh, now when he's down, now I can fuck these things over? Is that it? Shit, this is hard to figure out. Oh. Now I can shoot it. <laughs> you, come on now. There you go. Why didn't you say that before? Okay, F. I have to press F when I do that shit. Alright, cool. I just, like, stroke them a little bit and they're gone. Oh, there's more? Fuck me. Ah, damn it. Ah, come on, crystals. I know you want it. There you go. Get out of here, no, you. <laughs> the voice acting is very, very casual. Take out the crystals. Ah! Fuck. Okay. I'm probably gonna die. What the fuck? Since when can you do that? Really? You think so? You think so, you casual... Casual smasual? Oh, go fuck yourself. You... Fuck you. Ah! That's... <laughs> that is hardly fair. Oh my god, that's hardly fair. Are we done? Are we done with your fucking malarkey? Is it dead? I think it's dead. Ash, report this back. Fuck you. Uh. Oh. Pardon me? Have you invaded my computer? What the fuck, ass balls? What, when, where, why, and how? All right, I'll be right back just so I figure out what the fuck that was. Hey, you're seeing me for the third time today, isn't that something? So basically what that video meant was I needed to go and install VeraCrypt and figure out how to unlock a logged file that came with the game's download. Now, I'm gonna be honest, I'm editing this like a week in the future. I completely forgot what I did, but I figured it out somehow. And what lo and behold happened was there were some there were some uh, game files and some extra content. So yeah, hope you enjoy. Nightmare files. 4 minutes, huh? Oh cool. Oh, is this a little easter egg here? Oh, I can finally read it. Entry type event file entry Event type, uh, entity surveillance, 1912. Okay, let me read that through. Read this through actually now entirely. Am I recording? Entity five was tracked to be an urban city near site two. Two MTF teams, 
uh, were sent to, who the fuck are MTF? Were sent to block off a one mile perimeter around the entity's burrow. During that time, multiple purple spirit crystals, see entity number three, deposits were discovered and harvested. Entity 5's current target was also located and two MTF units were dispatched to follow the individual. Fortunately, due to the amount of obstacles along the victim's path, saving said victim was made impossible. The various obstacles, including rocks, cracks, puddles, and spirit crystals, all of which were likely scattered around each other to kill the victim or impede the MTF's progress. Discovery. Entity 5 was tracked by locating a large amount of spirit energy in the area around site 2 which was found to be emitting from a small cave underneath an urban city a few miles away from site 2 containment the victim was killed and n85 escaped however spirit crystals uh that were found were retrieved as well as the victim's path having been cleaned up the event was deemed successful wow okay wow this lore is pretty cool Ooh, we got a video i was falling Successfully evaded. Good shit, my slithery friend. Evading the alien men in black team. What about this? Puddle phobia file clearance. Whoa! Entry type presence, presence type unholy corruption, anomaly type crystal corruption, current containment status under surveillance. Fucking unholy corrupt shoots crystals. Damn. All right, you can skip this if you want, but I'm gonna read it all. Entity 5, Puddlephobia is one of our more unique creatures on file. Entity 5, oh wow, holy hell. Okay, this is kind of cool. I like the world that's being built right now. So I, wow, this is a huge world <laughs> as well. So it's kind of, is this inspired by uh, SCP at all? Uh, is my first question because, wow. This, this has a shit ton of potential to be ginormous of like a huge world with a series of games, which is probably your intent. But wow, is this kind of, this is cool. We just murdered Puddlephobia, but this is only five. Who knows what other monsters they're gonna throw at us. This is cool. I love the world building in this. It's super creative that you guys really shine. Uh, developers, you guys really shine with like lore building and that sort of thing. I was, um going through the uh the game and i was like eh, the gameplay is pretty fun but the lore the lore your writing is good is one of the more unique creatures on file entity 5 manifests itself wherever uh purple spirit crystals are found said crystals can be found within a few miles of where the creature currently resides it is undermined if this is a warning or bait regarding the creature it is theorized that entry 5 can summon create or spawn multiple of them to taunt prey it is undetermined which method above is used that being said entity 5 is not the worm like creature the entity itself is thought to be demonic corruption of the spirit crystal oh so it's like a manifestation specified information about the demon itself such as name class or otherwise remains unknown though is likely to be uh, any demon pointed out in biblical texts. This is Bible? What the fuck? It's not an alien, it's demonic. It's, just, it's from Earth, apparently. N85 was first discovered after deep investigation of a mysterious disappearance. Said disappearance was to be documented on a controversial documentary. However, after the documentary's creator received death threats from federal organizations, he stopped any and all investigation into the disappearance. After ruling out, he was on to them. After ruling out any natural explanation, mobile task forces were sent to the area. The disappearance was thought to have occurred 
and found clear signs of N85. The exact origin is unknown. Properties. As mentioned above, N85 uses an undetermined method of summoning worm-like creatures for not only defense purposes, but also for catching prey. It appears that N85 does not grow its spirit crystals in any known natural method. Instead, it opts to consume the spirit energy from prey it captures. N85 utilizes spirit crystals from various abilities, including the unknown method of the previous uh, mentioned creatures appearing. N85 typically makes a temporary dwelling in caves with high amounts of spirit, spirit crystal growth. What's a spirit crystal? Does it create them or does it like can corrupt spirit corrupt like natural crystals and make them spiritual containment currently there is no consistent form of containment method the entity's appearance is rare enough to remain hard to study but common enough to stay a threat currently the most that can be done is to intervene with the current prey's path to the entity's current dwellings as the entity will flee when it believes its prey has fled while it is a demeaning demonic entity its powers its power is limited to the spirit crystal it has on hand all right now we got nightmare files more pictures Ooh. whoa whoa is this the next game this has got to be the next game isn't it look at this i think they posted a video as well Ooh, i like this this is good this is good shit. Wow, okay. I'm happy I found the Easter eggs. Yeah, I'm happy I went through that effort. That was quite rewarding. Hello, me. That's why it's called Puddle Phobia. It's not the game, it's the fucking thing. I'm really happy I went through that because the gameplay uh, was pretty fun. There were some aspects to it that I wish there were like, okay, do this and do this. There were some things that were unclear, like pressing one to get the gun out was a little unclear. I was trying to figure that out for a little bit. Um, and same with the crystals, pressing F on the crystals. Maybe if you, like, get close to the crystals, it, like, F will pop up, and then it'll be like, press this to interact or something, and then you can do that. Or, like, right at the beginning, it's like, press 1 to get your gun out, and then it, then you know that from the start. But yeah, it was a pretty good boss battle. The music? Not bad. Not, not bad. Whoever made that, or wherever you got it from, not bad music if i do say so myself i make that so yeah not bad i'm really happy i went into this went back into this because um on surface level this game is kind of like a small little thingy but after that update wow does this open some doors because the writing in this is really great i love the writing it's super intriguing and the world that the writing depicts is huge and vast I think the the writing is way above quality for everything else. Like I feel like the the actual physical state of the world is decent. It's not amazing, but it's it, it gets the job done. Like the visual quality and that sort of thing. Same with like the audio and that sort of thing. Decent, 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 decent. Writing. Oh. I love the writing. The writing builds a visceral world bleh, world that gives me a lot of motivation to keep playing these games. So wow quite interesting i'm happy i came back to this are these guys trying to like set up their own their own scp their own scp universe what the fuck was his name i think it's a duo as well i'm not entirely sure don't quote me on this evard and isu i think are the names i think that's their names although i'm not sure don't quote me on that i think it's just i think it's just two people although it could be a plethora but cool really cool the writing is great um if you want criticism or notes of improvement definitely just like the overall visual style could use a little bit of a touch-up same with like the muzak uh the Muz it's both they're both great and get the job done they're all really decent but the writing is like way above pay grade right now <laughs> really good writing all right i've rambled on all, all i've rambled on long enough thank you so much for watching this has been just an ordinary bike ride and i'll catch you later mm -hmm.